Okay, one thing you're definitely gonna need, guys, is like I said, I'm gonna link it um, below in the description, what you guys need and what you guys will wanna use. Um, these are the two files you guys are gonna need. Only two, I promise you, it's not virus, and I guarantee you right now, and I'm gonna prove that too, uh, cause I know a lot of people uh, scan with Windows Defender. Let's go ahead and uh, do a quick scan. Scan now. Uh, desktop. I'm gonna select that folder. No threats. As you can see, it's 837. 837. No, no threats found. All eight files were scanned. So I can tell you right now, this is like literally a best thing to do. So these two you're gonna need. What you wanna do first is you wanna go ahead and open up the Fortnite spoofer Windows batch file. It is gonna be disguised as a Windows batch file, so just be warned. Open it. Hit yes. Once you hit yes on that, it'll out. I've already done this, so it's gonna open up. I don't know if it's gonna do it again for me or not. Um, you wanna close out anything Steam and Epics. You definitely the two. If you have those two, you definitely wanna close out. Once you open that, you just hit uh, follow the prompts that's on the screen. I, like I said, if I, I would do it, but I'll, I'll um you guys will find out when you do it if you do it. Um, as well as uh, hold on, let me exit out that. Let me sh let me see if I can redo it again. There we go. Well, I can't redo it again, but. I'm telling you, try, take my word for it. It's the best. And after you do all that, it'll take about at least, depending on how fast your computer is, mine is extremely fast, so it took me only literally two minutes. If you have a low-end computer, it's probably going to take 15. <laughs> and if it's going to if it's gonna take uh, a little bit longer than that, if you have a good depends or whatever it is, then you want to get Steam. You have to get Steam. It is a must because it needs to be disguised. So, for example, Steam. I'll um, go ahead and type my password in. You keep it. I love it. Okay. Once it's open, you want to go to your, you want to go to the library. If you don't have a Steam account, just make one. It's free. You know, you don't have to make no purchases on it just for this to work or nothing. So, uh, you want to go to Add Game add non-game and if you have uh what's it called uh installed um uh, fortnite and uh and the epics launcher go ahead and um it should be in this list but already, like i said i've already done this ahead of time so uh where is it epics launcher right there go ahead and just select from the list it implants it right there add select your programs um and then you want to open epics game launcher from steam from steam that's what you want to do that's a must if you do not do that i promise you that you will like it will not work facts and then from here you go ahead and go to this library and then go ahead and launch fortnite and go ahead and enjoy yourself and get yourself a dub <sighs> doesn't get any easier than that i it took me a, about almost a week of searching to find a uh, way to um change and this is the way it's the best i can tell you but uh if, you, if this helped you guys let me know if you guys have any problems with it let me know as well uh like share subscribe and comment after this video let me know what you guys think do you guys think that this work will work for you did it work for you if there's any issues please do let me know i do not own this uh file i'm just showing it off and um um case showing it i do not own this file I don't own no rights to this file, but I'm only sharing because it helped me out. And to the people that share that uh, hat made this file and that actually, you know, thinks it's a success, thank you. But until then, I'll see you guys on the flip side, and uh, see you on my Twitch too. Yes.